A warm welcome to the Palikale International Stadium for the third and final ODI between Sri Lanka and the West Indies. Yeah, for the first time in the series, the West Indies are deciding to bowl first. Let's take a look at the Sri Lankan side. Interesting to have Patung Nisanka back and, Ni and Nishan Madushka left out. Now, he was someone who was amongst the runs, but these are the regular openers for Sri Lanka. Yeah, three changes, right? So, giving the opportunity for the rest of the players who's been in the system for a while. So, I'm looking forward a better show from West Indies, especially look out for Gudakesh, who has been wonderful in this, uh, in this series, even the T20. So, hopefully, West Indies will put up a fight. Play! and dropped in the form Nisanka has been this year it's not a catch you want to put down Brandon King took an excellent catch at slip in the last game not to be today I was thinking the same it was Avishka Fernando that he took and everything very similar this probably might have been a little slower as well glorious what a way to return to one international cricket. Five for none. Second drop chance for the West Indies. Both openers now have been given a life. Apesh, but in the gap. Hint off with Nisanka. Plays it away. Too short. Back of a length, I'd say. Edge. Did that carry? And that's four. That's four. Short and wide. He finishes the over bell. Oh, that's the first rare short delivery which has been put away for four. Short delivery. Top edge. Six. Not this one. It's gone for six. The short delivery, Avishka Fernando. Lovely shot. What a shot to finish the over. Not the easiest shot to execute. Catch it. In the air and gone. He had done so well up until now. His wicket falls. Drinks come on. And so do the covers. And they'll come on and get those covers out as quickly as possible. And see that it's coming down quite steadily now. This is where we are then. Sri Lanka asked to bat first. The man who's gone, Avishka Fernando. That's the news, unfortunately, from Palikele at the moment. Play has stopped due to rain. And this is what it means. Revised playing conditions. 23 overs per side. Power play one. Will be overs one to five, power play two, six to nineteen, power play three, twenty to twenty-three. As I say, a very good evening to Russell Arnold. Hey. Evening all. Good signs, the crowd excited. Here's Chase. He's got that into the gap. Hit it well. Four. Great way to start play. Short ball, he's gone again. Same area. One bounce, four more runs. And now straight back past Rustin Chase. Swept away behind Square. That one's short. Plenty of space in front of Square on the leg side. It's another boundary. Five. The man comes into the one-day side, having rested in the first two matches, and shows his quality, Patum Nisanka. That's gone up, it's pace off it, but the line and the length wrong, and opportunity put down. Short, this time he goes in front, and all the way for six. Slapped away, two men back, but finds the gap perfectly. 
straight as an arrow. What entertainment here at Palikele. Gone. Alzari Joseph has a go and he gets his man. They had to run for everything. Yeah, and it had to be direct to get him out. So, Sri Lanka would not want anybody other than this man walking in at this stage. The captain, Asalanka. Well, we'll see. For now, let's enjoy Charit Asalanka. Down the ground. Has he got enough? Oh, yes, he does. It's 50. 50 off 19 to Kusal Mendes. Picked up. Now there's another chance. Finally. Final ball of the innings. It will skip away. And that is an outstanding effort. They run three. They make three. One on the throw, 156 for three. Good effort in the deep. 75 runs in 5.4 overs. Nisanka, 56, he was run out. Avishka Fernando, he'll be disappointed. Yeah, the uh, West Indian bowlers today didn't have luck on their side. West Indies searching for a first ODI win in 2024. Mm. Look for two. Uh, must be the one. Lewis wanted it. He's been dismissed, sweeping to teach Shana in the T20 series. This time, though, executes. And he's met with power from Brandon King. First boundary for King. Going straight up, but. Both fine leg and short third in the circle. So will be more runs. Ten from the over already for the West Indies. Just gets it past the captain. But not that field on that deep mid-wicket boundary. Patum Nisanka, who's worn the gloves at times. Quicker, it's four. Use the angle nicely, Evan Lewis. That's length, he gets on to it. Builder in the deep. Gets underneath it, takes it. Coming to Mendes. But he is a wicket taker. Sri Lanka will want him to get some wickets just to create some pressure. The umpires have picked up on it, so it's a no ball. There'll be a free hit. Turn square. Oh dear. He gets it this time. It's six. Che hoops off the mark with a six. That's four. Use the pace nicely. Down the ground. He's got hold of that. Flat six. He decides. I'm going to go leg side, feel the back. He's done well, Patu Misanka, to make sure it doesn't go for six. Unfortunately, cannot complete the catch. Patu Misanka, short in stature, but made use of it fully. Just like NBA player climbing high. What a hit. Two. Hats off to Evan Lewis. 11.50 in one day international cricket for the West Indies. My station into the attack. Ball in the power play. Three overs for 20 runs. Now, what's happened here? Evan Lewis looks to be in excruciating pain. Oh, possibly the ankle. He rolled his ankle, didn't he? Ah, that was painful.
the sound off the bat, clean. First boundary in 23 deliveries. Fielder gets there and takes it. Avisca Fernando and the partnership is broken. Attempted Yorker, but he's missed. May have made contact on the full. And over the top, will this split the field? He does. It's a welcome boundary. In the gap. Yeah, he just sensed Rutherford has got to take him on now. This over must go. First ball boundary. The power. The power and brute force of Evan Lewis. There is long on. He can't get there though. Inside out. That's six. Wow. Goes again. Mid off. Leaves, but it's another six. Up in the hundreds. Another four. Rutherford is hitting it all around the park. Short one, four. Chip shot, third man. Quality batting here from Shafin Rutherford. Work through, that's four. Use the pace. Nothing too wrong with the delivery though. And he goes down the ground. That's high. He's got enough. Into the 90s goes Evan Lewis. And you see it there. Full toss. It's six. All Nisanka can do is watch it go over his head. And make that three in three. A top knock. Just when the Windies needed it. It's been sheer power from Shafane Rutherford. And he'll get it there. That's a six. That's a hundred. And it's the game. West Indies win. Evan Lewis, take a bow. That's his fifth century. And third against Sri Lanka. Ten straight defeats. And on the 11th today, the West Indies victorious. In dramatic style. He limps to a celebration. Pumps his feet, Shafin Rutherford. Sri Lanka 156 for three. Kusal Mendes 56, not out of 22. Second quickest half century in ODI cricket for Sri Lanka. Nisanka got a half century as well. Then the West Indies chasing down the 195 that was required. Duckworth Lewis revised target. Evan Lewis 102 of 61, his fifth ODI 100. Kefain Rutherford's half century made sure they got home easy. West Indies winning the game by eight wickets, but Sri Lanka, they win the series 2-1. Subscribe now to enjoy sports from across the world.